Hey everybody and welcome. Today we are here in Nashville, Tennessee, and we're getting ready to try out a place where we watched a video on J&B in the Hills channel and Jennifer said, have you ever tried this place? And I said, absolutely never, but it looks so good. J&B in the Hills really sold us on this place. Jennifer's been here before, but I have not. So Gentry, where are we taking everybody to today? Five Dollar Bakery. Five Dollar Bakery. Jennifer is gonna start us off here with the purest. Look at all those layers. I really like that. Um, the donut itself is not too sweet, but then you have like the sweetness of the, the glaze. And the glaze is really good. I have like the little crunchies kind of on the outside. But yeah, I really like this. What are we trying next here, Jennifer? So someone a few months ago had brought some of these. Um, I've never had five daughters done this before and someone had brought some to our work. And um, I believe that they were more like this because I remember I'm having some kind of a cream in there. And I usually I don't like donuts that have cream and pudding and stuff in the middle uh, as much. But um, I really, really enjoyed these. So I have not tried the maple flavor in itself, but I did try a different kind. So this one's really good. I could do without the icing on the top though. And just like have the donut with like the sugar on the outside and then the cream in the middle. The cream to me kind of tastes like a mixture between pudding and maybe some cream cheese together or something like that. It's very light um, and it's not too sweet or anything. It gives the donut just enough of a moisture. And last but not least, carrot cake donut. I don't know how I'm gonna bite this one because it is so huge. So I'm gonna have to like pinch it or something. Let me see. I'm trying to get a little bit of the middle part. And it looks like there's like little pieces of carrot or carrot icing in there. So this one was very good as well. Um, again, I think with the icing on there, I'm not, to be honest, I'm not really much of an icing person, but I uh, could have done without all the icing on top and just enjoyed the donut itself. But I love all these layers. It's Kind of a mixture between a donut and a and a croissant but like a very really good one all right brent what are you gonna try so i'm gonna start off here with the maple donut the 100 layer maple donut you can see some cream in here you've got the uh, maple topping the icing another thing that stands out to me with look at all those layers on the outside but also there's sugar there's crystallized sugar here on the outside and this is definitely not something you probably want to eat if you're calorie counting uh, smells good. Let's see how it tastes. Part of the taste that kind of took me by surprise, and I can see them very clearly on here, but I just totally missed it because I'm just so in awe of the 100 layers. The cinnamon on top. There's a big kick of cinnamon when you first bite into this. I wouldn't say this is my favorite donut, but it's a very good donut. Next, I'm going to try the carrot cake. Right here, you've got the icing, you've got the brown sugar, you've got the the carrot cake icing and then right here you've got the cinnamon Let's see how this tastes i normally really love maple donuts but in comparison to the maple donuts this one is really good uh, this this one really stands out to me a lot more than the maple donut Ma maple donuts are usually my favorite it's very good and finally i'm going to try the purest here which what is this just a regular glazed donut this is a regular uh, hundred layer but that's just like your ba the basic one with the the glaze it's a very sweet donut <laughs> very sweet um, I think between the carrot cake and the purest, I think the purest is probably number one, carrot cake's number two, and then last, but a far last, uh, is maple donut. I need a, uh, yeah. All right. All right, so this donut here is supposed to have a hundred layers. It's almost like a croissant meets a donut, like a cronut. And Gentry's got one, Henry's got one. Yeah, it said yes, sprinkles, and I love sprinkles. You love sprinkles? And chocolate, and that's uh, the bee taste. <laughs> well, why don't you dig in and tell us how it is, buddy? Yeah, kind of like a croissant, yeah. 
Do you get more of a croissant flavor or a donut flavor? More both. About half and half. All right, Henry's gone in for his here. That tastes like bread. Tastes like what? Jennifer was pointing out right here in the maple donut, there's a little cream inside. And you said that this one over here, what was this one called again? This is the purest. So this purest. one is just like the regular glaze. Is there cream in there as well? I'm not sure. I don't see cream in that one. I don't see cream in there. What about the carrot cake? Maybe that's the one I saw. I don't see any in the carrot cake either. Looks like a little bit right oh, there. Oh, yep, yep, little glaze. Look at that. Ooh, that looks like it has cinnamon or brown sugar or something. That was Five Daughters Bakery. Henry, what did you think of Five Daughters Bakery? So we liked it. Oh, <laughs> you like the donuts in the playground the most, don't you? Yeah. Yeah? Or what did you like about the donut? Um, it was so good. And it was so fun, but I had to eat it all, but it was too much. All right, and Gentry. Oh. oh, we got some music here. We had some loud music in the background there, so it's, what'd you think, buddy? I gotta say, I watched the video from J and D in the Hills. Excellent job filming. I would definitely say that you should definitely come out here and just for dessert, you should definitely come here. How was your donut? It was excellent. You like the chocolate and the sprinkles too? Yes. All right, and Jennifer. I really enjoyed it. I um, think there are different flavors for everyone and, and different types of donuts for everyone here. So that's a really good thing. Um, I was telling Brent, I think that even their recipe that they have would be really good, like without any glaze on it and make it into like a breakfast sandwich. I think that would be really good with like some bacon or something like that. Big fan of the purist. That was by far my favorite. I really like the carrot cake. My favorite donuts, typically when I go to a donut shop, are usually the maple donuts. But their maple donut was a little overpowering with the cinnamon. Uh, and, and I love cinnamon, but it was just a little bit too much for me. Not that it was bad, but it was, it was by far not in the same league as the purist or the carrot cake. Every day is Saturday. If I could stop the time, don't you know I'm